Asante. Yeah, today I want to, the very sad moment for us in this region, where yesterday we had a fatal accident around Iguhu, uh, this is Kakamega County. Uh, we had two uh, vehicles, uh, passenger vehicles that were involved in an accident with a truck. And unfortunately, uh, as of today, uh, we have lost uh, 13 uh, people. Uh, yesterday, uh, we lost uh, 10. Uh, this morning, we've lost an additional uh, three passengers arising from the accident that occurred yesterday at around 6 p.m. Uh, the two Nissans, the passenger vehicles, were carrying uh, 34 passengers. Uh, so far, uh, 24 who had been admitted at the Google, uh, three who were admitted and discharged yesterday. As at now, uh, six are still admitted at our level uh, four hospital uh, in Igubu uh, Ikolomani. At CGH here, uh, we received a total of 14 uh, people. Uh, seven were treated and discharged. Uh, as at now, we have three uh, who are still admitted, but they are very stable. And as I said, in total, uh, we lost uh, 13 uh, passengers. Now, the cause of the accident from the preliminary uh, report which I've received from the traffic uh, police officers uh, is that there was a truck uh, that lost control while traveling from Kisumu to Karamega and it rammed into those uh, two vehicles. I'm also meant to understand that uh, this truck had worn out tires, uh, so basically it was on road work. And this is the time that uh, we need to call upon uh, the Ministry of uh, Transport uh, to instill the road safety measures. Uh, most of it to understand that the two uh, Nissans that we are carrying passengers, we also are uh, overspeeding. So it's the highest time that uh, we have a speed limit has been introduced, reintroduced, so that we can be proactive and uh, take care of uh, the safety of our people. It's also the highest time that um, the roadblocks, uh, which uh, had been removed from the roads, have uh, been reintroduced so that at least we have regular checks uh, on the vehicles which are unroadworthy, and that will go a long way uh, to prevent such a calamities. Uh, during this festive season, I want to call upon all the drivers uh, to take a safety precaution very seriously uh, because you cannot afford to lose lives the way we lost lives yesterday. And as a county, we are working very closely uh, with my neighbor, uh, Viga, uh, just to support the families uh, that lost uh, their lives and their, 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 their loved ones. And uh, this is uh, an issue that, of course, we're also talking uh, since universal health care. Uh, it cuts across, and I want to appreciate uh, all those who supported uh, the injured to quickly uh, be evacuated uh, to our facility here, and also at Igubu uh, Level 4 Hospital. As you are aware, health is um, a universal uh, uh, function, and we have no boundaries. So all those ambulances from Viga and ambulances from Kakamega that were supporting evacuation of passengers, I want to applaud you. And that is why we are calling upon all our colleagues uh, to support the matter of universal health coverage. And also I want to take this opportunity uh, to urge our people to register for SHA, because that's the only way we are going to support <coughs> our medical uh, uh, exercise. Otherwise, uh, Nico Hapa, Nabiongozi, uh, the county security team, Willin Mesema Pawali, Janet Ipuana Ajali, Mbaya San, and Bai Litokea, Kule Gugu, Mbapo to Lipoteza, Watu Kuminatatu, Na Tupona Familia, 
ambazo hivi sasa wale ambao walikuwa admitted kule Gugu walikuwa uh, watu 24 uh, hivi sasa uh, watu watatu wamekuwa discharged na watu sita ambao hivi sasa bado wanapata matibabu kule Gugu anatakia kila laheri waweze kupona kwa haraka na hapa katika hospitali yetu ya CGH uh, tulipokea watu 14 a uh, watu saba walitibiwa na wakatoka jana uh, wale ambao walikuwa admitted uh, watatu uh, wanapata nafu walitibiwa wanaweza toka leo na wengine wanaweza toka kesho nachukua fursa hii uh, kuambia wale madrivers wetu wote ya kwamba katika mwula wa Christmas uh, wale ambao wanaendesha uh, gari kwa kasi uh, ni vyema kutilia mkazo mambo ya speed. Na pia ni vema maskari wetu na pia waziri wetu wa mambo ya uchukuzi atilie mkazo sana sana mambo ya usalama katika barabara zetu na zile michuki rules nataka zikuwe reintroduced a, ili a, wale ambao wanatumia magari waweze kujua kwamba wanabeba watu sio baby a, mizigo waende a, speed ya ya, ya kadri kwa sababu ni vema madrivers wetu waweze kuwa waangalifu sana katika barabara zetu. Na ile gari ambayo ilisababisha ajali ilikuwa gari ya lori hapo hivyo. Na mimi anachukua fursa hii kuambia askari wetu ya kwamba zile roadblocks ambazo walikuwa naweka kwa barabara ni vema zirudishwe ili wakuwa wanafanya regular inspection kwa magari ambazo zinapita kwa barabara zile ambazo hazina tires ama hazina insurance itakuwa vema kuzuia ajali kama ambayo ilitokea jana. So nachukua fursa hii uh, kuambia pole wale ambao walipoteza wapendo wao katika ajali ambayo ilitokea hapo jana. Na wale ambao bado wanaokuwa au hospitali, uh, we wish them 